Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Mother's Day. Hopefully you've been spoiling your moms or spouses who are moms and all that kind of stuff today. Uh, as you can see, we're about to talk about iBots, uh, and I have logged into mine. Uh, as you can see, I've actually increased my investment on my main account. Uh, I do have kind of that 1K wallet challenge thing that I'm doing where they've been added as another table leg uh, with a small account that I'm kind of just growing a $1,000 wallet with. Um, and so looking forward to talking about them for a bit. Uh, as always please do like and subscribe down below to help bring more attention uh the likes obviously bring more attention to these specific projects if you're interested in them and really like what i'm talking about or the project itself then please give them a like and the subscribe obviously helps me grow the channel and helps bring more people uh to hopefully learn and earn and grow and um just be informed by what i'm trying to uh do and educate uh, where i can uh, as always this is not financial advice i am not a financial advisor and please do your own research uh, I, it, I hate that we have to say that every time, but it, I guess it is just a thing that we have to do to protect ourselves. Um, all I really try and do is provide education and hopefully it uh, helps you in your journey to earn passive income in this space. I think there's lots of opportunities, but there's lots of pitfalls and lots of minefields that I'm really trying to help people avoid and that I've avoided myself. So learning from those things and trying to pass that information on to all of you. On that note, uh, as you can see, we'd like to talk about iBots today, and there's a couple of updates, some that I put in the little snippet of what this is about, but a few things I want to get into first. Uh, a KYC is coming. Uh, this is a pretty exciting move from the team, uh, and we've always talked about doing it, uh, but I thought it was more longer term down the road, but they've uh, realized that this is something they like to do, but we want to do it, as always, responsibly. We don't want to pick uh, in a KYC company that doesn't act. Uh, because that adds no value and is just a piece of paper that you have to pay for. But we also want to make sure that it's not one that's going to act for the wrong reasons. Uh, because as you might know, this is a risky market. And if the value of the bots do decrease for whatever reason, although we're doing a great job, uh, the founders are doing a great job of managing it and making sure they protect our capital, which is uh, kind of... Uh, uh, need number one is to protect that capital for all of us. And then need number two is to grow it responsibly, which they're doing and done a really good job of since November 1st, kind of creating this, this really nice curve that we have. Um, so with that in mind, like I said, there's kind of that twofold opportunity. So I've found some people that fit that bolt. They've found some people and we're going to kind of weed them all out and get down to something that makes sense for uh, the protocol and for the investors that maybe have uh, or are hung up on that one thing, uh, which I don't blame them. Uh, and we always wanted, like I said, to get this route, but it just had to take time. So uh, excited about that. Moving on from there, the other big announcement that's again, not in that little detail is a TVL cap. We will be capping it at 1 million. We're not sure of the timing and how long this will last, but the idea here is we want to make sure, again, we preserve that capital. Like I said, that is number one priority, uh, and I think that should be number one priority of, of most protocols, is to find a way not to lose money, and then from there, hopefully responsibly earn money, which is what we're doing. So with that in mind, that TVL will come in place, and then we'll cap it to no new investors, uh, and compounding all that kind of stuff, and then we'll see how everything holds up, uh, do diversification further with other pairs or anything if we need to, and then once we feel comfortable that we found that kind of equilibrium and that we're able to sustain this really well, then we'll open that back up and keep growing again. Uh, so another great little move, I think, by the team to make sure that we're doing the best we can with your investments. Uh, the next thing, as I mentioned, is fees. So a couple of things here. And I want to make sure I explain this really, really well. So this specific, the first change that's happening is specifically on the my earnings part. So as you can see, you earn funds on what your my bots value is. And that part there uh, will have some reduced fees and is quite considerable. So right now, uh, when you go to withdraw, no matter what you're withdrawing, whether you're withdrawing from your my bots value or your my earnings, uh, the value gets charged at a fee of $5 if it's less than 500 and $500 if it's or 1% if it's over $500. So that's going to remain if you take any of your principal out. So the bot value that you have trading, but if you pull out any of your my earnings, it will actually only have a $1 fee now. Um, so that's a significant reduction in the fees when you pull out any of your my earnings. Uh, so that hopefully that's fairly clear and, and a, a neat change for and a great change for the protocol. The other thing that's changing is over here in the debit card. Uh, this is doing quite well. I have not used it yet. I do plan to, uh, but I'm just building my 
I'm building my MyBots value in order to create more earnings. And then as I get that high enough, I'm gonna start uh, taking my profit in the debit card, uh, just because I, I like what it's all about. And I, although I hate fees, I think there's some some neat fees here uh, that make it uh, reasonable because I'm avoiding having to go through an exchange, put the money in my bank account and all the tracking and stuff that goes along with that. Um, so yeah, so this is, I think, a, another great move. And what's happening here is the 8% 8, 8 deposit fee is being reduced to 6%. So because of the volume that we're getting from this and uh, they've been able to negotiate a better fee with the uh, person that's with the company that set it up for us uh, or that um, basically runs the the debit card so it's been a great little move again that's helped us reduce fees for you guys uh, hopefully there'll be more things like that as things progress as we start actually earning because now uh, that the TVL is growing that's giving us opportunities which is great up here uh, we're customing the 250k the quarter of a million which is fantastic and hopefully we're going to keep seeing that really nice growth and that organic growth that we're seeing right now which is amazing so uh, on that note, that's really all I wanted to get in through. This is just a kind of a quick little update. So I appreciate you taking the time to come by and listen to this. Um, have yourselves a great rest of your weekend. And like I said, sub like, subscribe, uh, join uh, iBoss Discord. Please join my Discord that I'm sharing with, with uh, Paul Dutton, uh, who's another great uh, educator in this space. And uh, I just appreciate all your guys' time and all your support. And have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful evening. Or afternoon still. <laughs>